is one of the queries that I often have when I find that there is something this oxidized on the outside, see, compared to the inside, which is clean <laughs> up until you get, here's the spout, and then inside is completely white over time. Apparently this um, particular vase was in a closet, but it's still quandary to me, and I've seen this over and over again. Here is how to tell whether there are cracks in the base when something's this oxidized. It's really hard to see. So what I do is I turn my lamp on and it's just like as if you're going to look at a stone, you know, and see the light in it. Same thing. So you just turn it. There's another little, you can see the light coming through. And then <clears throat> keep turning and here's another bad place. And what I do is I mark them with a Sharpie as I find them. Because otherwise, when it comes away from the light, it's hard to see. See? When you do have a crack like this, you have to clean where it's cracked. So I usually use a really sharp engraver. And I go in and I go on either side of the crack, both sides, front and back, and the two connecting areas. It's the only way it'll solder. Otherwise, if it's not clean, you'll just be adding, well, it'll be a mess, believe me. Okay. Once you clean the um, scene, what I do is I take my burnisher either this one or I take actually set my setting tool and I polish both to a high polish even though it doesn't look like it in the picture um, and I align the two places because usually when there's a crack one moves up this one for example the acorn has moved back further see so what I have to do is burnish it so it's connected to the other part of the metal.